Hey folks, if you like what you're seeing in this video, make sure to support my channel with checking out my Patreon to get some exclusive content like early access videos, behind the scenes stuff, presets, stems to my songs, etc. It supports this channel immensely and my project as a human. Thank you so much. Let's start right away with the feedback stream. First one is from Deal of Happiness. I like Bokchi the Rock. Um, let's see what this one is about. Straight up Silent Hill again. Oh damn, I love this. Some kind of effects, drones, and more like distorted industrial noises could help to get this like even more Silent Hill-ish, but the vibe is pretty cool already. Sounds beautiful. Love the guitar sound. I can and it's Ibex. I B E X. Ibex, Ibex, whatever. Yeah, really, really cool. Really cool chord progression as always, man. Your stuff is beautiful. Very Silent Hill, absolutely, and I love it. How it begins is just wonderful. Okay, got you, Christian. I will use the other one first, then. Welcome to the stream, by the way. How did you find out about the stream? I'm curious. Really nice, man. Big ups. Always interested about your stuff. Oh, Christian, that's dope. Shout out to Twitch, not gonna lie. <laughs> if you don't know it yet, feel free to check out my music. I would highly appreciate it. I can and yes, that, Ebex. Exactly. And next up, we got Mother, um, Armin, in the chat. Um, with another song, and I'm excited. I'm excited you finally have, like, a project name and everything, and I'm excited to hopefully... Um, Release your music in the future. Is the audio weird? Really? Like from the stream or? Oh my god, that was fucking loud and my heart just skipped the beat. I think it's kind of lacking a bit of high end and compressed in a weird way with some artifacts for me. Really, that's kind of weird. <laughs> Like that. 
I like it. Kind of reminds me of like Muerte, but more death step focused. <laughs> Oh, Insomnia, I know that Armin is highly inspired by my stuff, which is like a huge honor because this guy's killing it. And he has been like, he I wouldn't say he has been a student of mine, but we had like two or three lessons together. And his sound just shapes in a really good way. And I think he will get more and more unique. You really have to change the text, though. The text does not look beautiful. If you need the graphics designer um, for the text, hit me up. I will. I will link you with someone who might kill you. Really? It sounds like we hear the music two times at the same time. That's so weird. Should actually not be the case. And I mean, I... It's... You think it's fine? Okay. Wait, let me check that. Wait, let me check that. Wait, let me check that. Oh, Jesus. Let me check that. What have I done? Oh, no. Huh. I don't know, guys. And yeah, maybe we have to roll with it today. This happens with the kick, maybe a little feedback thing but it's not that there can't be audio feedback like there is no audio that could get picked up whatsoever that's the weird thing about it um yeah i don't know guys we have to roll with it today i guess um but i mean great idea but i prefer to have like stuff or feedback that is more than just a drop already just to give proper feedback how everything works together like this i just can say okay nice mix um, even though I think it could have a bit more high range, just feel less muffled. Um, I don't think so. Like, if I close FL, it should be good. No quit. I mean, I, I can try. But like, that that shouldn't change anything, I guess. But we, we will see. Um, and just in a core set of a song, I can give proper feedback how everything works together. But the idea is cool, the direction is cool, and your sound is shaping pretty well, which I highly appreciate. Next up, we got Ita from Lodian. Oh, guys, I think I know what it is. Oh, my. Okay, okay, okay. Um, I think now it should be better. Okay, okay. Onward, thank you for the sub, man. I appreciate you. Thank you so much. I think the vocal could be a bit sharper. Maybe layer like the same vocal but with OTT on it into the vocal just at like, I don't know, 40% volume or something. Um, to, to just give it a bit more cleaner, like a bit more cleaner high end and a bit crispier sound. Um, it's the rhythm guy, yeah, the, the melodic rhythm guy. Um, at my sausage party, why not? I do dealer, yeah, it sounds good. Especially with vocals. Oh yeah. That one's clean, dude.
I think this is your cleanest mix so far, right? Oh yeah, absolutely, man. You can hear the kicks and the, the clap really, really clean. Like the transient is really clean. And it sounds less convoluted, like everything that's going on. It, it's really clean. Nice mix, dude. So, somehow I kind of miss the more rough mixing approach, but I think like an in-between would be cool. It's way sharper, yeah. What do you mean onward? Synodubs, thank you for the sub, I appreciate ya man. Yeah, vocal definitely needs to be sharper, it sounds a bit muffled at the moment. Sound design is so good. Interesting outro, oh cool. Welcome then, sinner. Really nice tune, Lodian. Really nice as always. Your mix is getting cleaner and cleaner and I just really, really like your approach on the melodic stuff. It sounds so much better than most of the stuff that gets released and so much fresher. So really, really big ups on that. Nice chords, nice melodies, drums sound really nice. It's just refreshing to hear melodic stuff that is that well produced, honestly. Big ups. And not only the pitch map stuff. Now we got rhythm tonal plus intro, let's go. I love the pause here. Hope that's intentional. <laughs> oh, I like that sound. absolutely hate the snare here but the first one is sick dude this is dope the direction is sick but don't don't change the snare remember when we got paid for stuff like this dude we are still looking for stuff for our tarot compilation next year and um yeah i would love to grab this one my dude <laughs> Finish this up, dude, and send it over. This is fire. I, paid for I would play this out immediately, like in a code set. Stuff like this. Ah. Love the tonality, man. Damn.
damn, dude, the first half of the drop is so sick. Second half is also dope, but don't change the snare from the first one, please. Second drop, let's go. Oh yeah, dude. Oh, dude. Yeah, dude, this is fire. Finish this up and and shoot it over through the submission form. Um, I, I I got you on the release. This is sick, dude. This is sick, dude. Dude, if you finish this up until like I don't know next month. No, actually this month. Next month is December already. So this month, I will one hundred percent play this out. Not gonna lie, the first drop is so fire, dude. You guys, that's really really sick. Love the direction. Intro could be a bit more interesting, like another counter melody or something. It's just like this one plug that's playing. Um, but besides that, really, really sick. Really sick. Great sound design and stuff. It's really cool. Really cool. <clears throat> Next up, we got Cinna with track one, Ortris. Yeah, the panning is weird. Uh, sausage party, unfortunately not right now. I'm sorry about that. Maybe try a different browser. This is weird and experimental, but I like it. The panning of the snare feels kind of odd. I hope so, no quit. I have to say, I don't think the snare fits at all. Like, this has such a strong soundtrack vibe, and the, the snare kind of ruins that vibe, I think. Yeah, just a rim shot with a lot of reverb or something would be cool. Okay. So the problem is I don't really see the intention behind this one. Is it supposed to be like a dubstep song or is it supposed to be like a more um, soundtrack type deal? Um, depending on that, there's like different stuff I would say, you know? Melody is kind of goofy, yeah. Hey cats! Just an opener, okay. Yeah, for, for an opener, I think I really would get rid of the snare. Um, I said that many times. 
Um, and I would try to use like, I don't know, the melody sounds not 100% fitting, I think. Something less crazy and less synthesizer-ish would sound better. Something kind of more experimental, more um, analog, like, I don't know, different like, bells and stuff like that could sound better. It's kind of hard to follow this right now because the melody is so complicated, you know what I mean? It's a buff of November? What do you mean? Don't know what you mean, no crit. Oh, you mean this? Erscheinungsdatum. My pleasure, sinners. I like the tonality of this. The first half feels really cohesive, besides the snare. Um, but then the melody kind of ruins the vibe, I think. Everything else sounds kind of nice. Um, so keep it up, man. Excited for more, honestly. Now I got Arzen with Almost Finished. Same here. <laughs> Transition was a bit harsh, I think. Somehow it feels like power is missing. Is low end missing? And it's funny, the vocal is more stereo than the drop. That's why the vocal just um, feels way more powerful than the drop, actually. Um, but get more low end. Dude. Low end is there for sure, but it's not loud enough. Great sound design. It's so funny, this reminds me of a song of mine. Um, um Fuck, what's the name? Something with M. Uh, wow, well, which one was it? Wait a second. The synth reminds me of a song of mine. Ah, yeah, I got it. It's quite old, but... An ad? Really? Thank you, SoundCloud. Go yourself. Kind of, right? Not this part. This one. I 
I think it's a bit too noisy here and there. This sound is so sick. Jump, jump, jump. Nice one. This sounds even more noisy. The variation is kind of cool. Nice, yeah. yeah, main issue definitely less high end, more low end, and then you got a banger. It's pretty sick, pretty, pretty sick. And we got this house is chill as from Joran. Vibes. Okay. That's chill, man. Beautiful. Drags on here a bit. Another last post sausage. I actually think this works pretty good. Way better than a big drop or something. Um, just feels like a nice progressive house track. Um, not my type, but it's well done. Yeah. 
Well done. Well done, what should I say? Um, not really for my enjoyment, to be completely honest, but still, it's well done, and I have to appreciate that. So, big ups, my dude. Now we got base capture. Yeah. Um, give me a second, guys. One second. There is someone. <laughs> There we go again. Boop. Boop. The kick is way too distorted. It's way too crazy distorted. Yeah, I wouldn't do the fake drop that long, honestly. I just have like two bars of the melody and then drop it straight away. Yeah, it's it's better here without the fake drop. I remember a version that had a long fake drop here. It's better like this, but um, the synth just doesn't do a great job. Uh, the synth does not sound fantastic. This high-pitched super saw, I don't know. <laughs> Would be better maybe. Um, in general, the mix sounds pretty good, though. Um, but the the main transient on the techno kick just sounds, um, yeah, to less blop blop not transienty enough. Like the kick has no power whatsoever. Next up, we got the arrival from No Quid, stealing my title. Great intro already. I'm joking. Go. What? Yeah, yo, your stuff is way too good. <laughs> Can't even talk.
There's so much attention to detail with like the percussions and hi-hats. If you don't listen on headphones, um, you might not hear that, but the panning is so cool. Like there's so much cool shit going on. You got... I actually think here could be like a more lo-fi-esque drum section in this part. The metro drags a bit and there could be some some drums at least playing like the, the pattern of the drop um, to just have some, some cohesiveness in it. Besides that, pretty damn dope. Big ups, great sound design, great mix, just sounds fucking fire. Now you miss the balloons from Jasmine. Who's this guy? So let me guess. Actually, I'm not sure, but it could be a song about um, this freaking serial killer dude, um, Gacy. But I think he did not have balloons, right? It was just a clown. Whatever. What is this? Oh, I'm oh, king of the trees. I'm the tree meister. I count on them. Now he's Johnny Anastics. And run away like you. Tommy Noble. What the hell are you doing? Ah, oh, Jess, okay. Who paid for that floor? And me. No way. Never paid for no floor ever again. Not once, not never. Nope. Shit, that. Put that goddamn shit here. Not my chair. Not my chair, not my problem. No. No way. Actually, pretty good. What is this garbage? I think this yep, 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 this high sound in the background is not necessary. I think the low whoop whoop carries this one enough. It's Mr. Balloons. Stupid dresses, stupid flowers, lighthouses rule. You don't like the lighthouse? You suck. What is this, seahorse captain? What is this, seahorse seashell party? And what you can see is that the build-up here is just as loud as the drop. Not good, good. What do you mean, like me? They're fucking unreal, I love them. No. Blankets, towels. Yo, Echo. The trees and the tree meister. No way. Really gives me Vakan vibes in a good way. I love them. It feels like the, the drums are clap, uh, clipping a bit too hard. Um, besides that, it's pretty cool. Pretty powerful. Nice sound design. Finish it up. Next up, we got Sinus Infection meets NyQuil from Christian Wool. Um, I'm curious. Super Freitag, Super Samstag, Super Dude, good what are these commercials on SoundCloud now? Holy crap. Das Sparwochenende bei Kaufland mit tollen I do have an ad block. Angeboten, zum Beispiel Mon Cherie, die 315 Gramm Packung für 3,99. Und jetzt auch treue Punkte auf kaufland.de ah. mit der Kaufland Card. Einfach mehr drin. Cool drums sound really good. It's German, yeah. Oh, yeah, um, for next time, you are new, so you don't know it. Um, for next time, Christian, don't submit a released song. Um, I usually skip them. I will not do it now because you are new to the thing, but um, for next time, nothing released. No worries, man. The 
crashes up fire. Dude, this reminds me of like like some Cohen sound stuff right now. <clears throat> Well, this is interesting, dude. Let's take you back to a time when we were so much in love, baby. Ooh, yeah. Let us retract all the pain we cause each other so long, yeah. Okay. That's unique, dude. Drums need to be louder. What is up with the wave steps here? Huh. Yeah, I'm not a fan of the rave steps. Everything else was pretty dope. But it's unique though. Definitely interesting. Yeah, I... So, okay, um, the thing is, I hear that you're not coming from, from electronic music, but that's fine, because that's why it sounds unique. The only thing I would kind of steer towards the electronic realm a bit more is the drum processing. Make them a bit louder, a bit more punchy, a bit more compressed, low endy to just give them some kind of smack and connect everything a bit better, um, especially in the drops, I want to say. Um, they feel like really, really thin and stuff um so that that would be kind of a cool cool thing to get everything a bit more connected a bit more cohesive harmonies are dope not a fan of high-pitched vocals in for my taste i would just pitch them down an octave instead of high an octave would give a way better feeling to the song. Um, Christian, yes, sidechain is useful, but also just clipping the kick a bit um, would help. Um, but of course, sidechaining always helps to make um, kicks stand out more. Oh, the vibe here is dope, though. And the dissonance here carries the song. Oh yeah. It's pretty sick, man. stuff man looking forward to more honestly um hope you will be like a like a frequent watcher listener no attendee on these kind of streams i i love this direction um and i think if you shape it a bit more towards like electronic stuff this can be really unique 
Um, cool stuff, big ups. Next up, no, well, this is not about Next up, <laughs> Jesus, I really can't talk today. We get Who's Here Keys with Olympica Endlessly, Rough Draft. Let's go. And I'll tell you everything. The flashes of shooting stars were. If it's you singing, holy shit. Hundred wishes deep until I found your soul. Mm -hmm. So how did you do this? Jesus. How did you take my heart? I need to be honest. I used to think I'd have to give it away. And you never know this. Dude, if it's you singing, who's here? If you, once you see this, hopefully on YouTube. Ah, I miss it. D ah, missed. I I just sweared in German. It's not you. From the Is it like someone you know? The slit V guy? Vocals are insane, dude. I first saw you. I started wishing for nothing else. Writing is also pretty good, though. Oh my god! The harmonics, man! Oh my god! Can you tell the guy to hit me up? That little pitch band, like in the background on these, uh, I think it's strings or something. Pitch band, so dope. Ooh, gives it like some some atonality. Now. Like this. So dope, dude. Damn, dude. Holy shit. Dude, that's... That's a banger. That's... A beautiful song. This is just freaking good music. Right? Like, this is not only like, yeah, it's well produced, yeah, whatever. No, this is like really, really well written, well crafted, amazing freaking music. Big ups, man. Again, I have to say, though, the last, let's call it drop here to have like a cohesiveness. Um, could be more impactful. Maybe add like some some more like impactful elements. Um, a bit more impactful drums, a bit more low end, a bit more maybe a Reese with some distortion. Um, it's really freaking good, man. It's really, really, really freaking good. Huge ups. This is fantastic. Um, keep that stuff up, man. This is really, really great. This is really great. And again, if you are down to connect me with the singer, I would love to work on something with him. Um, could be fantastic, I guess. Big ups. Um, that stuff is fire. Damn. Next up, we got Fire Burst from Akeds. Let's go.
Catch me in the pit. I'm breaking necks and I'm wilding out. Reckless energy, I'm never signing out. Put my elbows up and my money out. Cause I came to get down, so let's run it up. Shut the block. You can catch me in the pit. I'm breaking necks and I'm wilding out. Reckless energy, I'm never signing out. Throw my elbows up and my money out. Cause I came to get down, so let's run it up. Yeah. I'm breaking next and I'm wilding out. I'm breaking next and I'm wilding out. Throw my elbows up and my money out. Motherfucking. That's unique. Ah. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah, this is fire. Hit the switch. Oh, the pause, dude. Hit the switch. Pauses, the flow. Oh my god, dude. Your stuff is way too insane. This shit is fantastic. The only feedback I want to give you is finish this up. Holy crap. Every time, dude. Big ups. Next up, we got AMSP with homework. Oh, oh, okay. Okay, okay, Sausage Party, wait a second. What did you do on this? Let's elaborate. Because that's the interesting part now. You mixed it, okay. And mastered, okay. But you did not do like, like you did not write this one, right? Recorded drums, okay, so you play the drums, right? Hmm. Vocals are given. Okay, okay. Dude, this is fire. <laughs> Gives me old school metalcore vibes and I'm here for it, really.
Mickey Mark. Actually sounds really damn good. It sounds really damn good, man. Oh yeah. Dude, big ups. The whole arrangement is like so classic old school metalcore in the best way possible. And I like that a lot. I enjoy this a lot. Gives me like throwbacks to when I was like 12, 13 years old. Um, big ups. Really, really nice. I enjoy this quite a bit. Big ups for sending all the stuff, guys. I really enjoyed it. With this, I will close the feedback for today. Um, there is more coming. Don't don't go away now. Um, we will listen to more stuff right now. I will make an extended stream today. Um, but yeah, thank you all for sending all that stuff. Um, if you watch this on YouTube, join my Patreon to get feedback on your music. And um, yeah, love you all. <laughs>